Hey guys, welcome to Desk Logic. This is the 15th video of the playlist that I have created for you guys on Adobe Illustrator for iPad. If you haven't checked out the previous videos, I will put the links in the description. You can check them out. So without further ado, let's get started. So guys, in this video, I will try to discuss the edit panel, which is available in the edit section of your application. So let's tap on that. So guys, as you can see, there are a couple of options in the edit panel. The three that are in a row are like the cut, copy, and paste respectively. The remaining two are copy appearance and paste appearance. So let's try them out. So let's create a shape, for example, square. And it's a constrained square and change the Swipe the colors, that black. Okay, now select this shape. Tap on this edit panel and all these options are now available. For example, if you want to cut any of the uh, shape, so tap on the scissor tool and it's gone. If you want this object back, you can tap on this paste icon the clipboard one, the third from the left, and the object is back in the artboard. Also, if you want to make multiple copies, you can tap on this second option from the left or the right, copy to clipboard, and just tap on this paste icon, the third one, the shape duplicated, you tap again you can create as many copies as you want so so these are the uh, options that are available in the, in the row so guys there are two other options which are the copy appearance and paste appearance so in order to understand them, let's uh, select one of the square and I swipe the colors. So now, if you want, uh, in any case, if you want this square to have similar appearance uh, with this black one here, so you don't need to you don't need to do all the settings that you have applied on this, on the color, on the fill, on the stroke. Whatever you have done on this one will be copied as it is to this square. I'm not talking about the shape. I am just talking about the appearance, which includes the stroke color, fill color, and other settings. So let's tap on this, go to edit panel, tap on copy appearance, then click on the square and again go to edit panel and now do paste appearance. And now it will ask you that what settings you actually want to duplicate. So I want both these settings, the fill color and stroke color. So let's tap on paste and here we go. So let's try out uh, this option with uh, some other shape. Let's tap on this circle, create a circle and maybe fill is white and stroke is black. So now, as we have already copied the appearance settings of this square, so if we select this circle, the settings that we have done with the square can now be pasted to this circle. So let's tap on edit panel and again tap on paste appearance. And again, it's asking that what settings you want to duplicate. So let's tap paste and here you go. So, 
both these settings, the copy appearance and paste appearance, doesn't require similar shapes. You can paste these settings on different shapes, like we did with the square, the similar one, and the circle, the different one. So guys, that's it for today. I hope you liked this video. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one.